Hello everyone. Welcome to FLM and in this session we are going to discuss about a Salesforce developer roadmap, okay? So here I'll divide this concept into multiple phases, okay? Multiple phases ga divide cheddamu and then we'll break it all. Okay, dan tarvata okati we'll try to analyze and we'll try to understand what exactly and how how a student or a candidate can be a Salesforce developer. okay so the very first phase okay here phase 1 okay phase 1 is all about all about foundation of salesforce okay ante very basics anamata foundations of salesforce ante salesforce ante enti exactly okay so ikkada what is salesforce and telusukovali okay then uh, what is crm and else quali okay so crm is customer relationship management if you have gone through the demo ok sa demo chusunte meeki concepts baga clear ayi untayi okay so next what are the products of salesforce okay in which industry in which industry industries salesforce been used okay salesforce is used okay ఇదొకటి అండ్ క్లైంట్స్ ఆఫ్ సెల్ ఫోర్స్ హూ ఆర్ ద కస్టమర్స్ ఆఫ్ సెల్ ఫోర్స్ ఓకే సో ఇది చాలా చాలా బేసిక్ అండ్ ఫౌండేషన్ థింగ్స్ అండి ఓకే ఎవ్రీ సెల్ ఫోర్స్ డెవలపర్ ఆర్ అడ్మినిస్ట్రేటర్ హ్యావ్ టు నో అబౌట్ దిస్ అనమాట అంటే ప్రతి అడ్మినిస్ట్రేటర్ కి డెవలపర్ కి దీని గురించి ఈ ఫేస్ వన్ గురించి తెలిసి ఉండాలన్నమాట ఓకే నెక్స్ట్ ఫేస్ టూ వేర్ you have to learn all about admin anamata okay admin in the sense chala basic concepts untayandi like you know and again admin is completely no code anamata it is no code or let's say low code actually no code okay no uh, let's say no coding ankonde okay uh, no coding environment సో ఈ ఫీజ్ లో అసలు కోడింగ్ అనేది ఉండదు అనమాట కంప్లీట్ గా ఆ టూల్ నేర్చుకోవాలి మీరు ఓకే సో ఇక్కడ ఏమేమి నేర్చుకోవాలి అంటే ఫస్ట్ థింగ్ ఈస్ ఆల్ అబౌట్ అప్లికేషన్స్ ఓకే ఆ అప్లికేషన్స్ ఎలా ఉంటాయి అప్లికేషన్స్ ఎలా క్రియేట్ చేయాలి ఎక్సెట్రా ఎక్సెట్రా ఓకే దెన్ ఆబ్జెక్ట్స్ ఓకే ఫాలోడ్ బై ఫీల్డ్స్ ఫాలోడ్ బై relationships okay ivi chaala basic concept anamata uh, where ok application uh, is considered as a set of or collection of objects anamata okay so ee application imagine this is an application okay ee application lo multiple objects untay anamata okay ee multiple objects is a collection of a single application anamata okay so ee objects lopala malli again in this object you will have multiple fields anamata okay you have an n number of fields you have a multiple fields ikkada okay so e e object ni okay let's imagine e object ni e object to ante object 1 ni object 2 to connect cheyali ante vaadi concept e relationship anamata okay oka object ni inko object tho connect cheyadam okay is all about relationship so ilaga basics you have to cover in the administrator anamata so idantha manam without writing a code chestam anamata ante oka single piece of code rayakondane idantha manam perform chestam okay so after relationship okay um, there are certain other concepts inka konni concepts unnai jaise ke like like uh, web 2 case web 2 lead okay lead uh, conversion okay ila kaakunda inka inka unnayandi page layouts okay inka validations and jeppe is very important concept okay record uh, i mean reports and dashboards and jeppe is okay very important concept followed by this is securities okay securities okay okay chaala chaala ante chaala important okay ee securities ana concept lo malli sub concepts untai jaise like owt sharing rules 
grant access using hierarchy next profiles and jpc okay permission set and easy okay permission set sharing settings and jpc okay so you have multiple concepts and amata security chala and chala and chala important and amata banako so this is the phase two uh e phase two low mir ev ka kunda uh you will also learn something about automations and amata okay automation such as flows okay uh workflow rules etc okay so e concept even me comes under admin without coding okay uh this is phase two and amata okay next is phase three e phase three low phase three is all about development and amata okay development now development contains again uh very important uh aspect on the market and you could development contains a, a programming language called apex okay it is very very crucial very very important language to learn when it comes to salesforce salesforce kunna okate uh programming and this is apex programming language okay next e apex kaakunde e apex lo ne you will also see something called soql okay and sosl okay so soql ante ikkada this is a query language anamata ante sql lanti ide okay kagavadi we call this as salesforce object query language anamata okay whereas this one sosl we call it as salesforce object salesforce object search language anamata okay so there is a slight difference between soql and sosl but major uh, majority ga soql e vaartar anamata okay so development lo ee basic concepts andi prathi development prathi programming language lo unna undalsina concepts such as loops gaani okay or uh, uh, the conditions gaani conditional rendering antaru okay or let's say uh, conditional statements antaru right so these statements like you know if if else okay if else if etc etc ikkada kuda untayi development lo kuda untayi and chaala chaala ante chaala easy ga untayi anamata ee concepts okay then comes trigger triggers so ivanni apex classes and ట్రిగర్స్ లోనే వాడాల్సిన కాన్సెప్ట్స్ అనమాట డెవలప్మెంట్ అనేది డెవలప్మెంట్ ఈస్ ఆల్ అబౌట్ ఎఫెక్ట్స్ క్లాసెస్ ఓకే అండ్ ఎఫెక్ట్స్ ట్రిగర్స్ ఓకే సో ఈచ్ ఇంతవరకు యూసి దిస్ ఈస్ ఆల్ అ బేసిక్స్ ఆఫ్ ఆర్ యూనో లెట్ సే బిగినర్ ఫ్రెండ్లీ కాన్సెప్ట్ ఆఫ్ డెవలప్మెంట్ అనమాట ఇవన్నీ ఓకే ఇవన్నీ చాలా బేసిక్ కాన్సెప్ట్ ఆఫ్ డెవలప్మెంట్స్ అనమాట దీన్ని దాటి ఈస్ ఫేస్ ఫోర్ that is advanced development advanced development okay now ikkada in this advanced development here in this advanced development you will see concepts like asynchronous apex asynchronous apex anamata so this asynchronous apex again contains uh, concepts such as future apex okay schedule apex Cubal Apex, okay, and Batch Apex, okay. So, even the Chala advanced concepts are not matter when it comes to Salesforce development. It is a good idea. The next concept you have is unit testing, okay. Chala and Chala and Chala important, okay. So, this, these two concepts, when it comes to advanced development, these two concepts, it is a good idea. Next is the integrations, okay. integrations again in integrations lo we use rest or soap anamata soap apis okay so e use chestam ikkada integrations lo evi gaakunda platform events ana anjepe oka concept undi adi and uh, there are some external applications like you know postman gaani or uh, workbench gaani okay uh, we use these concepts anamata when it comes to integrations ave kaakunda you have HTTP methods are not there, okay? Methods, etc, etc. So, this concept is called for advanced development, okay? And FLM, in FLM, we cover all these phases very smoothly, very interestingly, okay? Next, uh, 
phase four, phase five. Soon after completing phase four, phase five is all about is all about deployments and the matter. Okay, deployments. And then you see here, you involved a concept such as sandbox. Okay, change sets. Okay, productions. Okay. E concepts or say anamati kadaila ante manam chase development gani or admin uh admin ki sammaninchina anything gani. Okay. First we do everything in the sandbox anamata. Sandbox and using change sets, change sets wadukoni, sandbox nunchi anta testing anta ipo in tarawata ante develop chase dani test chase in a tarawata using change sets will deploy it in the productions anamata. Okay, so e deployment concept is really very important and very crucial. Manako. Okay, next soon after learning these things, phase six. Phase six is all about LWC. Okay, here LWC. LWC stands for Lightning Web Components. Okay. So, e Lightning Web Components also contains HTML, CSS, JavaScript. Okay. Evi Kha Kunda. We use some tools, uh, coding tools such as, you know, VS Code or Ant Migration Tools. We use these kind of applications. You know, we also use an extension called Lightning Studio. Okay, Lightning Studio extension. Okay, so E6 concept will cover it in the LWC. Inka chala on the LWC gurin chapala and inka chala chala concept on the uh, if you go through our con uh, content, okay, ma browser FLM ka browser me choose in the kada kawal china required LWC concepts and mention Jason Tayande. Everything we have noted and uh, everything we have mentioned that is required to get placed in the industry. Industry lo place our danki required unna prati LWC concepts gani or development concept gani le the admin concept gani. Prati di a browser loan tundi. I request everyone to visit the website and see the browser. Okay. Then idi ka kunda. Next phase six, phase seven. After completing phase six, phase seven uh, is about projects. Complete projects. Okay. We provide you a real time projects. Okay. Our real time projects choose student new projects. Ive ka kunda. Let's say projects and uh, placement. But again, before placement, there is one more important thing uh, comes into the picture. Ain't ante certifications. Okay. Anyways, here real time projects. Okay. And certifications. So major ga chala mandi angel ante admin certification jasaru first. Then the other development certificate jasaru. But it's up to them actually. Uh, candidates but uh, candidates mentality but or the industry requirement but kakavote. What I suggest is if you having PD1 is enough. Okay. PD1 is like platform developer one anamata. So this certification will help you a lot to get pleased anamata. Okay. This certification will help you 100% in the placement. This will increase the weightage in your resume 100%. Okay. Idi Kakunda followed by we have admin and followed by we have business analyst certification okay business analyst certification is also you can do uh, if you are trying to hit the business analyst job role me job role a business analyst job role try just to take a business analyst certifications you can do leda admin certification you can do because the business analyst value they cannot do the pd1 in the country complete development side on the matter so what i request is According to the qualification, education qualification, if you are from the technical background, technical background, technical background, educational technique, technical background in education, okay, in your uh, master's gani or you know, uh, uh, bachelor's degree gani, 
ఒకవేళ మీది టెక్నికల్ బ్యాక్గ్రౌండ్ ఉంటే యుఆర్ ఎలిజిబుల్ టు డూ ఆల్ ద సర్టిఫికేషన్ మీరు ఇందులో ఏ సర్టిఫికేషన్ అన్నా చేయొచ్చు ఆల్ ద సర్టిఫికేషన్ ఓకే నెక్స్ట్ నాన్ టెక్ బ్యాక్గ్రౌండ్ నాన్ టెక్ ఎడ్యుకేషనల్ బ్యాక్గ్రౌండ్ ఉన్న వాళ్ళు ఐ సజెస్ట్ నాట్ టు డూ పీడి వన్ ఓకే డూ బిజినెస్ అనలిస్ అండ్ ట్రై హిట్టింగ్ ఫర్ ద జాబ్ ఓకే సో నాన్ టెక్ బ్యాక్గ్రౌండ్ అంటే ఎవరెవరు యూ సీ this is bba okay and mba these two people or bcom tisconi you know uh, commerce gaani vere vere dan tisconi untaru kada vallu adi technical background ante uh, let's say btech okay any degree in btech okay btech lo a degree ena is fine okay all kaakunda bcom okay bcoms uh, computers ledha uh, bsc computers okay bsc or uh, you know msc computers okay we will do uh, uh, be for example okay uh, these people are eligible to do all the certifications on the mat okay and they have more weightage okay ivi kaakunda inkoti let's say trial head trial head uh, points so trial head is a unique concept okay uh, e learning platform antar actually uh, e learning platform ante akade manam salesforce yokka major concept nerchukochu uh, but again it it is a time taking process kagapothe when you complete that learning a learning will complete chese unte ganaka meeku koni points vastay anamata so points and rank vastundi okay trial head points and ranks this also increase your weightage uh, resume weightage anamata trial head is must anamata prathi salesforce uh, developer gaani admin gaani veela andarki trial head is must anamata okay so this is the road map and then we have the placements okay phase 8 is for the interviews phase 8 is all about interviews interview preparation or you know interview and interview preparations okay so idanna mata this is a road map of a uh, salesforce uh, developer uh, how to be a salesforce developer let's say or how to be a salesforce admin or business analyst immediately e di avvalanna meeru admin ga vellal anukunna ledha developer ga vellal anukunna or ledha you know uh as a business analyst ga vellal anukunna you have you need to go through all these phases anamata if phase is one phase two phase three uh phase four is advanced development right again the de- deployments lwc vanni kachithanga nechukovali meer particular ga phase eight uh, phase seven is very important projects and placement ante ikkada placement kit kavalsina requirements anni okay project and placement requirements anukundam okay placement ki kavalsina requirements anni ikkada rasa ikkada rasanu and eligibility kod rasanu so here uh, you guys follow this accordingly okay what i request is follow this accordingly and get ready for the interview now when it comes to interview if it interview lo entante what all you have to do first strong resume linkedin okay linkedin okay get your linkedin anamata ante linkedin nunchi chaala opportunities vasayandi linkedin asal right iskolem man linkedin nunchi chaala opportunities chaala ante chaala opportunities vasay so adokati inka mock interviews so flm your your the students you know we uh, conduct the quizzes anamata in flm we also encourage to participate in the quiz evaraithe ba perform chestaru will also try to have a mock interviews for them okay and then followed by interview grooming okay uh, like how to behave in an interview etc etc communication okay మీ కమ్యూనికేషన్ స్కిల్స్ చాలా బాగుండాలండి సో విల్ ఆల్సో యాజ్ యూనో ఇన్ ఎఫ్ఎల్ఎం వి ఆల్సో ప్రొవైడ్ యూ అ గుడ్ సెట్ ఆఫ్ కమ్యూనికేషన్ క్లాసెస్ ఓకే ఎక్సెట్రా అండ్ దెన్ యూ ఆర్ రెడీ ఫర్ అన్ ఇంటర్వ్యూ ఓకే సో దీస్ ఎయిట్ ఫీసెస్ ఎవ్రీ వన్ హ్యాస్ టు గో థ్రూ అండ్ దట్స్ ఆల్ అబౌట్ ద రూట్ మ్యాప్ ఆఫ్ అ సెల్ఫ్ okay hope you guys found this session informative okay that's all for this video thank you so much for watching